I never played Genshin Impact. I heard this game is like Genshin but better and it just launched so I hopped on the bandwagon. Now I'm not new to mobile games on PC. The unstable 60 FPS cap, terrible sensitivity sliders and locked keybinds. This is all familiar to me. But I got used to it before so I gave the game a fair chance. Combat unfolds something like this. If it's one enemy then I might be able to dodge a few lucky times. Multiple enemies becomes Minecraft kid PvP. All that careful dodging and counter attack is out the window. I'm butterfly like clicking 20 cps now i like shooting guns so if we ignore her personality chiza is my favorite character unfortunately her double pistol dps is tragic they should have gave her an ak or something put like a blood sport skin on it give her a vandal at least all right let's talk movement because this is my main interest i like the wall running it kind of reminds me of prince of Persia. it does this cool flip instead of bumping into ceilings if they're short enough otherwise it just runs forever. I like how it wraps around pillars, looks goofy as hell. The air dash is a nice mechanic but can only be done once per jump. This and the grapple are the only way to redirect movement mid-air as there is no air control without the glider. It's all fun in games until you run out of stamina. Stamina is the worst mechanic to ever be implemented in video games. You can't even stick to the wall and wait to recharge. The glider requires stamina too. Only option is to drop and tank the fall damage. Why is there fall damage? Explain to me why that's interesting because in the real world I have to write up lists of stuff I have to go to the grocery store to buy and I've never thought to myself that realism is fun. I go play games to have fun. Yes, yeah, see here. I still have no idea what the story is about. Supposedly this guy fell from the upside down ocean and now he's fighting tacit discords and ghost rider. He's got some mythical absorption powers with his hands. You cannot convince me this scrawny high school looking kid is the messiah of Jinjo or whatever. That's like calling the Kung Fu Panda the Dragon Warrior. The Panda? Master, that Panda is not the Dragon Warrior. He wasn't even meant to be here. It was an accident. Lil Bro thinks he's the main character. It seems like I need a certain level now to continue the main story. Getting some deja vu here. I hope you didn't think I was about to grind some weeb ass mobile RPG. You brazy broski. 